guys, today I'm going to show you how to use the Prestone antifreeze coolant tester. On this uh, coolant tester device here, one side's red, which is the hot side for up north or down south temperatures like Florida, Arizona, stuff like that. And then on this side is for up north temperatures. Now in this case, for up north temperatures, it says it doesn't want you to be any lower than 37 Celsius. So 37 Celsius is right here. So that would mean don't go any lower than that because then you're going to have freezing point. For the hot side, it says don't go any lower than 129 Celsius, which is a boiling point of 265 degrees so or Fahrenheit. So you're not going to want to go any lower than that because then that's where it's going to boil. Recommended is 129 Celsius. So you're going to stick this rubber hose down in either the radiator or your overfill bottle. Mine's a little low so I can't quite get it all right now because the car was cooling down. Um, so we're going to stick it. I'm going to stick mine in the overflow. I'm going to hold it. You're going to give it a good squeeze. And you're going to suck all the coolant to the very top just like that and leave it in there now if you can see I don't want to suck in any air so I'm going to hold my finger over it if you can see where mine's at mine's showing 124 Celsius so that's no good 255 degrees is my boiling point so I need to get it up to about 100. 29 Celsius which is about 265 so in order to do that I'm going to have to add pure concentrated uh, antifreeze not the 50-50 stuff this ratio right here 129 Celsius is based off of 50 percent conditions which is 50 percent water and 50 percent coolant well guys I hope you enjoyed my how to use a Prestone antifreeze coolant tester uh, like always if you guys enjoyed my video Please subscribe. The, bot uh, the button's always down at the bottom right hand corner. And also check out my link right here. It has all kinds of how to videos and uh, to my website.